All right, yesterday at the family reunion, which was a big success, thanks to my sisters, to everybody who planned it, um, really great to see everybody. So on the chance a few of you might watch this, I think a few of you will, it's the next day, and uh, the running joke was, well, you look really good for your age, so I'm about to let you in on a secret. This veers in the dad joke category. Apologies for that. There's plenty of bad dad jokes out there. I don't need to make any more. How do I look so good for your age? For my age? Oh, and this is for my friend Xavier as well. I noticed a, uh, you've got the pull-up routine there in your house. You know, you're doing that. But I thought you, you could work on your, your lats, your core, your triceps by doing this. So what you're looking at inside this grain bin, there's two loads of oats in here, I think, that red uh, grain truck we dumped in. And they're a little bit wet. The moisture is 15.5 to 16%, and we need to get that down to 13 or 13 and a half. And the way to do that, once it's in the bin, this floor is perforated, little holes in the floor, and there's a big fan on the outside that blows air under the floor, the air comes up through the floor, eventually out all those vents up there, and it dries the grain down. Well, the problem is the floor is only held in by the weight of the grain. It's just laying on top of these supports. So if the spreader, which is why you got this uh, conical shape here, eventually it will make its way out to the edge, but within, there's a, when there's a small amount of grain in, it doesn't make it all the way out to the edge and there's a danger or a problem with the floor blowing up. So I come along with this concrete rake and grab up here. I'm only using one hand now, but you use two hands and just pull it down. And as you can see, let's climb up here. I've already done all that all the way around. And all the way over to here. So Zave, um, here's a big uh, million dollar idea. You can franchise this, I'm thinking. People pay a lot of money to go to a health club, to trek through the mountains. I'm on a little hill of oats here. Um, and you get a fantastic workout. And uh, you can go to parties and people say you look good for your age. I'll well, say thank you. It's due to this... Uh, Daily bit of uh, type of exercise. So all dad jokes aside, that's what's going on here. Uh, it's still early in the morning, Monday morning, or 10 o'clock at this point, but the oats are still a little bit wet. There's dew from last night, and I have to repair the head still. So I'll go up to deer and get the parts for that. There's some uh, fingers that are on the auger that broke off. I'll swap those out, and maybe by noon today I'll start combining oats, and there's... I don't know, 60, 70 acres to go. Depends on uh, how the stand looks, but we'll get them in here today and tomorrow and then dry them down. I'll probably put some air on them here once I get this floor leveled out a bit. And we'll see, uh, see what we end up with. So thanks for watching. Oh, there's a ladder to get out when the grain gets too tall. And you wear a safety harness so you don't... Uh, fall into the grain and be suffocated by piles of grain. So, safety first. Oh, there's Carl, come and check things out. He can't get up in here. I did have a squirrel get in here somehow. Last year, year before. Eventually I got him out of here, he left by himself, so. Thanks for watching, bye.